Hello. Thank you so much for your time. I know you must be busy, so I'll be quick. I'd like to show you how Avocode can help you and your team build better digital products faster. By that, I mean websites, newsletters, mobile apps, and really any type of screen design. Nowadays, more than ever, many non-designers need to participate in the design process. And that's where Avocode really shines. Avocode makes it really easy for product managers, front-end engineers, copywriters, and any type of stakeholders like clients participate in the design process by collaborating on design files. And they don't need to invest in any design tools whatsoever. Let me show you how it works. Avocode app works in the browser, but it also works on your desktop. We have a Mac, Windows, and Linux application. Currently, we support five different design formats. Figma, Sketch, XD, Photoshop, and Illustrator. Adding them is extremely easy. You can simply drag and drop them. And if you're curious, we also have plugins. If you're using Adobe XD, just download our desktop app. It auto installs your plugin and you're good to go to sync any amount of designs straight to Avocode. If you're using Sketch, simply open any design, go to plugins, Avocode, and sync selected artboards. If you're using Figma, simply go to their community, search for Avocode, and install our plugin. Then simply go to any Figma design, go to plugins, Avocode, select a few screens, and hit export. Once you have the design in Avocode, you can simply open it to do many things. You can go back to Figma right from here. You can start inspecting, commenting, style guide that's currently in beta, but if you're interested, we can tell you more. And then you can edit copy or preview and edit the flow. Avocode versions all of your design files. So if you want to see the changes, you simply click here and in the split screen, you can see that this Figma design changed from black to green, and you can also describe these changes. This view is currently available for Figma and Sketch, and all other formats are also versioned. That means you can go back in time and also download them in any state they were in the past. Let's say I just want to take a look at this design. So let's go to comment. So I can see that this design has two artboards and I can start commenting on them right now. What if I didn't like the copy? I can simply go and change it. What if I wanna see the logic between the screens? Well, you can see that the connection from Figma was imported. So you can see that the interaction from this button leads straight to this page. If you don't like that, you can simply remove the connection and create a new one. Once you're done, you can play the flow. You can simply preview it, check what's clickable, and navigate. And what if I really like this design and I simply want to start coding it? Well, Avocode can help you a lot in that. You can simply click around to start measuring distances. So here you can see the size. If you hover, you can see the distances. You can also multi-select multiple items. Measure again. If you want to copy the text, you just double click on it. If you want to export image assets, you just double click on them. If you want to start writing your style sheets, you simply select an element and you can copy individual values from here or you can go to code and copy the whole code snippet. If you wanna edit the code settings, go to code settings and edit it to your liking. You might not be using only CSS. Avocode can actually generate code in 10 different languages. So here you can switch to any language and simply copy the whole snippet or any amount of lines or individual values. When you're done with the coding, you might want to check if your developers coded the design really precisely. And we have a right tool for that as well. So let's say we go to this website and we want to take a look if all the paddings are done exactly as the designer suggested. 
So let's scroll to this section, for example. I'm going to open the original design and app code, and I'm going to open the pixel checker. This tool opens the design in a transparent window. You can decrease the opacity, scroll to the specific section, and pin this window. And you can position it on top of the coded result. You can see that the sizes are a bit different. That's because of the responsiveness. But clearly, we can already see that the padding here is correct, and here, below the icons, not so much. So this is a signal for the testing, the report, and issue. Without it, you might not know, and your design would not be pixel perfect. So that was just a quick demonstration of what Avocode can do nowadays. If you're curious about any of what I was showing in the past, let us know, and we'd be happy to talk to you in more detail.